All right, guys, welcome to episode two of Internet Security. Um, I had a lot of people ask me, well, how do I secure my network? So it's real simple, real easy. All you got to do is if you're running Windows Vista, like I'm running Windows Vista Ultimate because I can, I got it for free. Just click start. In the bottom where it says search, type CMD. It's going to bring up the command prompt. Normal people know how to do that. You're going to type in IP c o n f i g and give you a whole bunch of useless shit so scroll up to the top and you're looking at the default gateway if you're on your wireless so my default gateway is 192.168.21 you're just going to remember that keep it in mind and you're going to open up um any kind of internet browser i use firefox because it's faster and easier all right so all right my internet's taking forever you go up to the search bar, just like you type in an address, and you type in that default gateway, 192.168.2.1, and this is you. You're now you're now inside of your router. Um, you can change a whole bunch of stuff. You can look at a bunch of things, parental controls, change, restarting your router, things like that. Um, it's real simple. You're gonna go to wireless, which is over here on the left side of the screen, and then security. And to secure, like right now I have it on 64-bit web, just because, you know, for this tutorial. You want your security mode to be WPA. Um, I'm not too familiar with the Radius server. I will make another video on showing you how to use the Radius server. I need to make one first. Um, the no server one's real simple, real easy. TK, TKIP is your, you know, your pretty much your default, as it says up here. Um, your pre-shared key is just like using your web key instead of just numbers you have everything you can type in I like elephants if you want um, it's gonna be a lot harder for people to get into your um, passwords WPA is a lot harder you need a huge dictionary to crack it um, and the nice thing about WPA is you can put spaces and symbols and stuff um, which makes it even harder to crack alright and then you just hit apply changes and uh, you're all 